everyone, I am back with the book review of Ben in Your Shoes, and this is a Christian inspirational book of poetry. It is by Crystal London. So, having said that, if you're not like the most spiritual or like Christian person or you don't really get into all of that, this might not be like the book that you're going to reach out to read initially. Um... It does have a lot of, like, talk. Obviously, it's, like, it's really, like, a seriously, like, a Christian, like, motivational type book. Like, the poems in it are really nice. But I tried to give the disclaimer, like, in the beginning, like, if you're one of those people that's, like, I don't really subscribe to that or I don't believe in that, like, this might not be the book that you're gonna exactly find comforting or find, like, that you relate to. Now, if you are into those kinds of books... I do feel like this would be a book where you would be like, you know what? I feel like that's worth my money. I feel like that's something I'd relate to. Because I did notice this book is not on Kindle Unlimited. This book, I want to say, was $3.99 or maybe $4.99. I want to say it was like $3.99 on Kindle. So you are able to still find the book on Amazon. Now, the poems in the book, there's a bunch of different poems in here. Um, I'm trying to count. There is at least, I'm trying to like count really quickly. There's at least 20 poems in here. And by 20, I mean, there's definitely way more, but there's at least. But a lot of the poems in the book are talking about God. It's talking about believing in God. It's talking about holding on and basically persevering through your hard times. It is really big on having faith so I'm I'm trying to find the words for it because it's just like I don't know like it was so kind of like self-explanatory that like if you need a motivational book that's how I'm gonna say it if you need a motivational book where it's like a book of poetry and you want to strengthen your Christian beliefs I would recommend this book for you me personally I feel like I don't really know I don't st- <laughs> I don't really stand anywhere anymore when it comes, like, to the whole, I don't know. As far as Christianity and stuff goes, it's not that I don't believe in God. I just don't subscribe to certain parts of what many Christians believe anymore. So that's why I felt like I might have been a little bit biased. But it's not like I was annoyed by it, though. That's the thing. I did find the book interesting. I did find the um. I found the poems nicely written, too. I can say this was one of those books where I was like, damn, like, okay, I'm not trying to swear. But (laughs) for the simple fact that it's a Christian book, like, I was like, it it was edited nice. Whoever did that, like, I don't know, as someone that does do proofreading and editing, that's one of the first things I notice. And I'm always like, hmm, like, I pay attention to it. I also like how it was formatted. One of the things I liked while I was reading it on the tablet was how, like, the... What do you call it? The title of each poem? See, I don't know what color it would be when you guys are reading it. I don't know if it differs from, like, the page color. But I noticed that, like, the title of it was, like, highlighted, like, blue. Like, it was, like, a bright bluish, like, baby bluish for me. So, like, I didn't have to sit here and ponder, like, was this a new poem or is this a continuation of a poem that was just previously written? So I like that. Now, she has more books that are out. I am reviewing another book by her very soon. So, check out Crystal Lunyon. She has a Facebook for sure. Um, She has a Facebook. I'm trying to see. So, now, it's saying that the book is 80 pages. So, it says, well, for me, it says typical time to read is an hour and 36 minutes. So, that is all I can really think to say about this book. Because, again, it's a short... um. It's a short book, but I do see someone being able to buy it and gift it to someone that you know goes to church or someone that you felt like needed um, encouragement through a hard time or even if someone that had just got out of like a hard time and they just enjoy reading inspirational Christian poems, this will be the book for them. So that's all I have to say about this book, you guys. I will see you in the next book review. I'm out.